colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Oksana Cherkasova and I'm from Volgograd State University, Russia. Now I'm going to present the research under the name Green University Garden Towards Rich in Sustainability, which was conducted by me and my colleague Dr. Marina Fadeeva. First of all, I would like to describe briefly what this paper is dedicated to. Our topic is included into the sub-theme Green Campus Design in Universities of the present conference. Therefore, on the example of the inner garden of Volgograd State University, we describe the importance of greening the external campus sites for minimization of the negative environmental and health effects for students and faculty staff. Growing actions on putting into practice the policy for improving sustainable development gives universities great variety of opportunities on implementation of different green technologies in their campuses. Implementing green technologies, the university shows its prudence and readiness to behave responsibly, sensibly and maturely in response to sustainability issues of the present and the future. Sustainability should be intrinsic to the institutional mission and therefore implemented in different formats to all campus operations. Universities have a crucial role in educating and disseminating sustainable ideas among future generations. They, in turn, will spread the ideas further, become policy makers and implement their initiatives from regional to global level. While composing the present research, we were sticking to the opinion that Green Campus is the basis, a starting point for sustainable campus initiatives implementation. It is the place which significantly affects and is affected by students and faculty staff. That is why we looked into the basic type of Green Campus, which covers a green infrastructure, green and territories, in reference to Volgograd State University. In fact, green campuses can be divided into several types. The first is a green campus, as I mentioned above, which includes green in territories in and outside the university, changing infrastructure for the better environment. The next type combines the first one and educational aspect, which means that alongside the implementation of weak initiatives to the infrastructure, this approach includes the educational processes and practices. Another green campus type is equal to a sustainable campus in its essence. The additional components to the previous ones are self-consciousness, finding research sustainable solutions, strong interaction between universities, companies, organizations and society for reaching sustainability. It should be stressed that eco-initiatives may depend on the type of higher educational institution, climate zone it is located, current environmental situation of the region, as well as its economic potential. Volgograd State University is quite young, only 40 years old. Looking to the past, to the early decades of the university campus development, it gets obvious that plenty of efforts were made to its flourishing. Speaking about the Valsu history, it should be mentioned that the main campus was only built in 1990s. Since those times, the university administration, faculty staff and students dedicated a part of their university life to campus advancement. And on figures 1 and 2 you can see the result. It now features a great variety of forest and plot vegetation, fully open spaces and sites for biodiversity. The inner garden is designed in a way that students and university staff can escape from the tough daily teaching and learning routine. It has numerous fixed benches with several street lamps for night lightning. Due to the construction of the whole building, it fully receives the natural light of, all, of the whole day, and shady places are suitable for shade-requiring plants. Through the use of strategies for Sustainable development, universities can actively create eco campuses that not only reduce the environmental, the environmental burden on the city, but also can influence public opinion and behavior of citizens in order to develop environmentally responsible behavior and activities. While two initiatives carry great innovative potential and can contribute to the formation of green infrastructure, ensuring the improvement and green development of the city and the region as a whole. Here are our contacts. We always strive for new cooperation. Thank you for your attention.